want to play this video. Okay. Well, it's another flashback clip for you, okay? Take a I look can't at wait. Look at this. You know, to, to meet with the people and talk with them and just interact with them is such a great thing because they will buy CDs to people who are nice to them and definitely talk and, and interact with them. And that's that's why people talk that stuff. I really don't know where you're finding this stuff. Well, I, that one's actually, I think, CBC Edmonton, I think, where we got that. But you were very confident, even at that age, about the business yeah. part of this. Where did that come from? I don't really know. I mean, my, my folks were big supporters, and my mom I always had the gift of the gab, and sort of my grandpa bear. But, uh, I mean, I, I don't know. I just, I really don't know where that came from. Okay. And nobody else in my, my family ever played really music at all, so. I, I love, I follow you on Twitter. You're also on Instagram. Uh, and whenever you post hunting pictures on Instagram, a whole bunch of people like it, and oh. a whole bunch of people don't like oh, it. Oh, yeah, I get in trouble yeah. uh, for that. But, um, I mean, it's, I come from a hunting background, and, yeah. I mean, growing up on a cattle ranch, I was, I mean, somebody was even making fun of me wearing scarves and stuff yeah. like that. It's, you we're can't win. We're on the cattle ranch wearing scarves? Yeah. It's it gets like, windy. Uh, and it's every, every cowboy's got a scarf. But anyways, when it comes to hunting, we, we really have a good time with yeah. that. And, you know, uh, who was I talking with earlier today? Who uh, was talking about Ted Nugent likes to hunt, but he yeah. says, I don't kill anything that I don't eat. And same thing with us. Well, We're going to eat it. What was it like the first time you got those, the negative comments on your pictures? What was that like? Well, I kind of felt that it was a, a bit of a, a measure of success because nobody, you know, you rewind a couple years, nobody cared what I did. Right. And now kind of people care, so. But even the thing about the scarf thing, and some, only some guys make it fun, there's this idea of what masculinity means and what right. the rural masculine is and what it is supposed to be a man. Are you figuring that out now? Well, I am. I mean, it's my wife's been a stylist for many years, and she, you know, uh, she and I really have, a, I think, a good thing going on with trying to be different in style. And now that I'm at a point where I can do that, right. I'm, I'm happy to do it because you still keep some country elements, but you, know, you don't want to alienate the urban fans, but right. you don't want to alienate the country fans, so we, we try to find a happy medium.